if you don't know where your collagen is coming from, it could be coming from Tyson chicken bones, or it could be coming from the hides of cattle that are from South America that right. are being grown in areas of the Amazon that's being deforested for more meat production, right? It's a byproduct of some really, really nasty things. Right. This is the only bovine cattle collagen that exists that actually is able to say reduces wrinkles in 28 days. And this is deep wrinkles. Welcome back everybody to the Healthy Habit Podcast. And look who we've got here. She is back folks, practicing herbalist, licensed acupuncturist and trained home birth midwife. Carrie G. Patterson is joining me today on the program. Carrie's the National Educator at Natural Factors, an Ishura certified supplement company. Natural Factors products are used by practicing clinicians all across North America for various different health situations. Welcome back to the show, Carrie. Thanks for having me once again. Hi, everybody in all of the hot places around the country. And um, we hope that you are staying hydrated. Absolutely. And we actually have a hydration IV special going on at the clinic right now for that very reason. It's getting hot I, over here. So I didn't know that, but yeah. great. Absolutely. I would, I would definitely <laughs> jump on that if I were there. Today's Today, we're diving into collagen, folks. There's mm -hmm. a lot of interest around this topic. You know, collagen is different from something like whey protein. No, it's not vegan, but it is a different part of the animal that's being used. Let's dive right into it. The stage is yours, Carrie. Set the Set the topic for discussion today with collagen. Yeah, I think collagen is something that everybody's talking about, right? Um, I saw collagen being sold in Bed Bath & Beyond before Bed Bath & Beyond wasn't there. <laughs> so it's literally everywhere, you know, and I know we've talked about this in the past, like, please don't buy a supplement at 7-Eleven. Please don't buy a supplement at Bed Bath & Beyond. Right. Go right. into your local health food retailer because Collagen is something that I do have concerns around quality measures. I do have concerns about sustainability and things like that as well. However, it is something that is really taking off. And I think for a good purpose, I think that there's always a reason behind um, supplements trending. And I, I fully believe that collagen is here to stay. Like it's not going anywhere because so many people are seeing such incredible health benefits from it. Not only like, yay, my hair, my skin, my nails, but we're seeing changes happen internally. And so when right. I think about collagen and I think about the longevity of it and why I'm thrilled that people are starting to educate themselves on the importance of it, it is because of the internal support that we're begin going to be getting, you know, bone and joints, um, as well as gut health and, and cardiovascular health. I was going to look this little thing up right before, so maybe we can yeah. jump on the Googly machine, but I was trying to remember the percentage of our uh, venous system, our cardiovascular system is actually collagen. I think it's wow. like 70 to 80% of our, you know, our vasculature is comprised of collagen. And if after the age of 19 or 20, our collagen levels start decreasing significantly, right. this is where we start seeing things like, well, you can imagine, you know, collagen keeps everything plump and happy and spongy. And if that's going away, what's happening to your plump and happy and spongy veins? Very good point. So. Yeah. And as you just mentioned, I did pull it up here. I mean, blood flow, you can't have proper blood flow without collagen no. and elastin and, you know, all the blood vessels need it. You know, collagen is also present in all the smooth muscle tissues, blood yes. vessels, digestive tract, heart gallbladder, kidneys, everything. It holds everything together. It holds right? everything together. Yeah. It's the glue that keeps everything together. So we really, I mean, you know, it's be like, yay, collagen, but it's, I think it's yay collagen because it plays such an instrumental role in every aspect of our bodies. Um, and so it's something that, you know, I think historically, if we go back and look at uh, I really, really like, so everybody who's listening, I highly recommend checking out the Price Pottinger Foundation. Okay. Um, so this is the original Weston Price Foundation and with his partner Pottinger. And so make sure you're looking for Price 
Pottinger Foundation. Um, but they are consistently talking about traditional diets. And we go back and we look at traditional diets. You know, bone broth was a significant part of it. There were a lot of more collagen, you know, containing foods in our diet. So now it's lovely because this is where, you know, I think last time we talked about um, being able to have, you know, science support supplementation, right? You know, we always want to respect what we had historically, but if we can have something new come about based upon research, based upon just, you know, production capacity, like what can we figure out? And then collagen is one of those that um, it's really so easy to supplement with this, you know, put it in your tea in the morning. I have been doing waffles mm. um, with collagen and I'm throwing in the um some fiber source the relief fiber as well you know nobody has an idea that they're getting collagen and fiber when they're eating a nice fluffy waffle so you know right. it's something that you can incorporate into to most things why do you think collagen has taken off is it because the anti-aging you know people want to improve their skin hair nails and just be more youthful that's probably yeah it. i think that's probably it you know i think it's one of those things that started trending as far as hey um you know you don't need botox you can use collagen instead you know and these things are very expensive right. and we have alternatives to really help that um and, you know, and there are on the scale of collagen sources, like I was saying, I have concerns about about sustainability. I have concerns about cleanliness, you right. know, toxicity levels in collagen. Um, there are some superior collagen sources. And if we're going to be taking collagen, that's what we need to be looking for is these superior sources that are, you know, they have proprietary processes for how they're manufactured. They also have the research and data behind it. You know, it's that thing where you can like walk in and you can take something. But if, you know, the reality of it is, and you know, this is not a nice thing to say, but okay. if you don't know where your collagen is coming from, it could be coming from Tyson chicken bones, or it could be coming from the hides of cattle that are from South America that right. are being grown in areas of the Amazon that's being deforested for more meat production, right? It's a byproduct of some really, really nasty things. So within the structure of this, this is where we always talk about, you know, like you've got the top quality, the good quality, and then you have the like, please don't. <laughs> Please don't take this quality. <laughs> so especially with collagen, this is one where we really, really want to right. look for those top sources. Tell us about whole body collagen then. And we have a bottle of this right here at the house uh, or total yeah, body total collagen. Total body collagen, That's yep. Right. Tell us mm -hmm. about this product. What's making it unique compared to, let's say, other collagens on the shelf? Well, we've talked about synergy in the past as well. You know, I'm sure you talk about that pretty much every single podcast, like looking for ingredients that can come together and support and add layers. Right. And collagen is one of those. You can actually support and add layers. So that's what I love about the total body collagen is that you're not just getting collagen in here. You know, the reality of it is this probably... 95 to 98 percent of people that are buying collagen are looking for fine lines and wrinkles and skin and nails right you know and i'm totally fine with that if that's why you're doing collagen thrilled because you're getting all the other benefits you didn't even know about <laughs> um it. and total body collagen in addition to having the collagen source the superior collagen source we've also got vitamin c in there which really works with collagen so they help synthesize each other. We've got hyaluronic acid, which is all about helping with hydration in skin and the joints. Um, glutamine is in there as well. Glutamine is a really, really lovely amino acid for the digestive system. So really supporting the digestive tract, but then also helping with mus muscle sy synthesis. So this is why a lot of people, you know, collagen can help. Like um, I have somebody who works for, well, Yolanda Fenton, I think we've talked about her in the past. She's our mm -hmm. director of product right. um, innovation and development. She is, I think, ranked like number 66 in the world for CrossFit women, like insane, right? Um, and she said she started taking total body collagen and added like two inches onto her biceps just from adding that like post-workout really to help because that glutamine is helping with muscle synthesis. It's helping the muscle to rebuild and repair quicker. 
We've also got biotin in there, which I think is a is a nutrient that most people are have heard of, right. maybe for skin and nails and things like that. Um, and then we have tryptophan. And that's what's interesting about collagen. If we just go, if we just go with what we've read online, we probably haven't been fully educated about what collagen is. And collagen is a really, really big chemical structure. It's a protein structure. And proteins are comprised of amino acids, right? Um, right. And there's a an amino acid that is missing from collagen. So it's not a complete protein is what we would say. So if you are somebody that's protein deficient and you supplement with collagen, your body is probably going to go, oh, so close to being a protein. Right. Let's steal tryptophan, which is, you know, it's a, it's an amino acid that we can store up in our body. It's really supportive for sleep. You know, it's like that turkey, right? You eat a ton of turkey on Thanksgiving and you get sleepy because of the tryptophan. Right. Um, so, you know, it's going to steal tryptophan from our reserves or other parts in our body to complete that protein structure. So that's another reason why I love the total body collagen is we've added the tryptophan in there. So you're seeing these synergistic ingredients to make sure that it works in the body the way it should work, but we're also getting those extra beauty benefits. But it is the varicel, it is the source of collagen at the end of the day, that is the secret. Sure, compared to something like a ribeye steak, you know, you got collagen, mm -hmm. which has way more glutamine and proline and hydroxyproline and mm -hmm. glutamic acid in there compared to, you know, typical beef products, right? Yeah, and that's an interesting thing, way to think about it is, you know, even protein coming from plant sources, they all have different chemical structures, right? You know, there's like the basics of what would be considered a protein structure, but those, those you know, peptides can yeah. really be created in, in different fashions and the body sees them in different fashions and utilizes them and breaks them down. And so, you know, that's another thing about collagen that's really interesting is it's a really, really, really big peptide um or structure it's a really big collagen structure and so it's actually one of the ones that's the most difficult for the body to break down and utilize so that's another thing is if we have that's why I, another reason why i love the glutamine in there we've added the extra because if we have digestive issues we're probably not even breaking down the collagen right. so that's where you want to look for something that says bio you know bioactive like hydrolyzed bioactive peptides that means it's gone through a process to break it down into smaller chunks where it is easier than for the body to digest tell us a little bit more about the varisol and collective like collective but call yeah, like col c-o-l-l -L, like collagen yeah so we have our bovine collagen which we we're talking about that's you know the cattle and things yeah. like that um so that source of our collagen is actually varisol you can look them up they have a great website and all of their research and data is on there these are pasture raised grass fed cattle that are from canada and the united states so that's really cool we know exactly the source we act, know exactly where it's coming from but Verisol is a branded source. We've talked about branded sources in the past as far as, you know, we know that they've got amazing clinical research and data on it. Right. This is the only bovine cattle collagen that exists that actually is able to say reduces wrinkles in 28 days. And this is deep wrinkles in 28 wow. days um it also has some amazing clinical research i think it's the only one that has any research done on cellulite reduction and then you know there's research into bone and joints and things like that as well so you know this as far as i'm concerned varisol is the superior source um because of that what we know for the deep wrinkles in 28 days is that it's really highly concentrated. So, you know, we, you're, you only need 2.5 grams in order to get that. So when yeah. you get that full scoop with the 10 grams of Verisol, you're adding on all of those other benefits of the cardiovascular um, and, and the bone and the joint and the tendons and the digestive system and things like that. Right. So for me, it's just, it is that superior source. Then you mentioned Colactive, um, which is, you know, there are some other companies that utilize Verisol, but we are first to market as of now here in the United States with mm -hmm. Collective. And I'm really excited about Collective because you know me and fish. Um, yeah. <laughs> that is the Alaskan in me is always going to be like, uh -huh. where's the fish? Yeah. Um, and so with Collective, it's actually our marine based. So this is suitable for vegetarians 
If they're okay with doing fish in their diet, then they can have the marine collagen. It is a sustainable fishery. It's off the coast of France. So it's a co-op of French fishermen that actually catch this sustainable whitefish. And it's processed in France from Collective. Interesting. And what's really cool is that Collective has figured out how to not only capture collagen from fish scales, which every marine collagen out there, that's where the source comes from, is the scale. And that's probably why people are like marine collagen's nasty, right? It's really right. fishy. It's really icky, like all these things. Well, Collective has figured out how to also get it from the scale or from the skin of the fish in addition to the scales. And what's great about that is that they're actually capturing elastin as well. You mentioned Alaskan with the cardiovascular system. So they're getting elastin at 6%. That's what we're seeing in the collective collagen source. And that's the exact same ratio that we have in our skin. Wow. So the other thing that's really cool about collective is they have the same research um, pretty much as Verisol. So 28 days for fine lines and, and deep lines and wrinkles and right. crow's eyes and all of those things. So here we're looking at two sources and then, you know, the icing on the cake being everything goes through Ishura. <laughs> yes, absolutely. To confirm everything. <laughs> to confirm. And, I, there's yeah. a white paper. Um, if anybody's interested, you know, we could, you could probably Google it, but I could certainly get it for you as well. There's a white paper that I think like the detox project put out where they went into a store and grabbed a bunch of collagen off the shelf and tested them for yes. heavy metals huh. and found insanely high levels of like mercury and arsenic and cadmium and like scary stuff. And this is in collagen oh, that people are buying every yeah. single day. So, you know, it goes back to like looking for those third parties that are testing for, for things like that. And if for all the YouTube viewers, you can see here, I pulled up from naturalfactors.com, total body collagen, bioactive peptides. Everything we're discussing here is found in this product. And here you can even see, I love that you guys included the amino acid profile. I don't think people realize mm -hmm. how big this is, how important this is. Like collagen is really low in methionine, which is you don't want tons of methionine floating around your bloodstream and more of things like the builders, like the glutamic acids, the glycine. Tell us yeah. a little bit about glycine carrying like anti-anxiety. You know, people don't get enough glycine on a daily basis. No, but I think it's glycine's fascinating from the perspective of, you know, we can take certain nutrients like magnesium, this glycinate, right? Yeah. Magnesium. When we see magnesium citrate, I love magnesium citrate, but magnesium bisglycinate, mm -hmm. what that means is that it has the glycine okay. added onto it. So all of the, the mood benefits, this is one of the things we see with glycine, right? Is it's really supportive for like mood and sleep and things like that, really helping with the body processes. And so when we have, that's why magnesium bisglycinate is the one we always talk about, like, you know, it's in the, the better sleep products. Like yeah. we, it's, it's supportive for health helping you to relax. It's supportive for helping mood and sleep more so than some of the other magnesiums. So it's a, it's a fun thing to think about how we can, we can utilize these amino acids in, in other fashions. As a matter of fact, it's the high, it's the highest number out of mm -hmm. all the amino acids found in collagen. Glycine is by far the most, look, it's almost doubling all the other tripling some of them really all the cool. other amino acids in there so that's how important that is so yep. amazing that's the total body collagen how is that different from the total body multi-collagen the multi-collagen yeah so um the multi is the one that i've been playing around okay. with lately it's unflavored so i just put it in my tea in the morning i don't even know that it's there and what i love about this is it doesn't have those synergistic beauty ingredients like we were talking about so you're not going to see like the vitamin c and the biotin but what it does have is it has Verisol and Colactive. Mm. So you're still getting those beauty benefits. But in addition to that, you're gonna see two other branded ingredients. You're gonna see NEM and UC2. Now NEM is uh, the, that's the eggshell membrane. And that's one that I know you guys have standalone on your shelf in this at, at Healthy Habit as well. Most of your health food retailers are gonna have NEM. So, yeah. and this is one, uh, an, a product um, that an ingredient that has a lot of research around bone, bone and joint health, specifically like 
the cartilage, the lubrication of our joints. Um, and most studies, what you see, it's interesting, is that they always do joint studies on, on knees because it's easiest to see changes in knees. Okay. But we can assume if we see a study where it's like, whoa, really great results in knees, all your joints are going to benefit the exact same way. Um, so NEM has amazing, amazing research into it. And it is a, you know, it's an eggshell membrane that um, is also, you know, sustainable and, and all of the good things that we want to see. And then I actually wasn't very familiar with UC2. Uh, this is another ingredient that some some health food retailers will have on the shelf as a standalone, yeah. but I love having it incorporated in here. And UC2 also has really, really good research into the joints and the cartilage and the synovial fluid. And that's the liquid that keeps everything bouncy and happy in yeah. our joints. Um, it also has some interesting uh, research into what it's doing in the gut. So UC2 is working in some inflammatory markers in the gut to really help deregulate things. So, you know, for me, one of the focuses of UC2 is to, you know, turn down some of those immune system responses hmm. that are happening in the gut that might be causing um, long-term issues. So, you know, it's one that I've really been looking at as far as like, wow, what is, what else is this doing in the body? So, you know, what we talked about at the beginning, the total body collagen, where we've got the, you know, the lovely collagen, the varicel or the collective and those synergistic ingredients. For me, those are the ones that's like, Ooh, you want to look better, right? Okay. You, you want to, you want to look good. If you're the person that you want to feel better, you want to feel good, like your focus for collagen is more of the bone and the joint and, you know, that sort of supportive aspect, then the multi-collagen is the way to go. Um, it has types one, two, three, five, and 10 in it, which is, you know, there's, there's some other multi-collagens out there that say like, you know, we have all the types of collagen there's like 29 different types of collagen. I don't think we need them all. The body yeah. knows what's going on. The body's going to convert things. We also only really have research on one, two, and three. So those are the things you need to focus on. Those are the things you want to get. Um, but having this like, gosh, four different branded ingredients in there with all that clinical research and data, like I hmm. didn't realize that my sacrum was hurting me from sitting on airplanes all the time <laughs> and I was taking the multi-collagen and then I didn't have it for a couple of days and I was like whoa achy back yeah. so um I mean it makes a difference yes. that fast which is really really cool folks we're talking with Carrie G Pattison here national educator at natural factors all things collagen total body collagen then there's total body multi-collagen as well mm -hmm. I'm glad we've hit on the arterial benefits, vasculature benefits, cardiovascular in general benefits. I have a patient who he swears that since I got him on the collagen, his blood pressure has been way lower than it's ever been in decades. So Makes again, sense. we're not giving medical advice, but I'm just sharing no. a potential benefit here. That why, is a great why do you think anecdote. That why, why do you think that might be happening? Great anecdote. And it totally makes sense, right? It's what we were talking about at the beginning. Like if you have your skin is dry and wrinkly and, you know, as we age, crepey skin, things like that. The exact same thing is happening on the inside with mm -hmm. your cardiovascular system. We want it to stay nice and spongy. And if things aren't able to move and, and bounce back, right, from things. Um, so that's actually an interesting side note, you know, like a, a sign of not having enough elastin in your body is you wake up in the morning, you've got like, you know, the lines, the creases mm. from where you had your head on the pillow, you know, that, sh that can happen, but it should within an hour or two bounce back. Right. If that, if you end up with those all day long, oh, this is a collagen elastin issue, but you know, same thing happening in our venous structure. Think about as things get more brittle and more hard, what happens? And as we're trying to push blood through there right. and something's brittle and hard, it's not going to bounce back right. as, as readily. It makes so, sense. So totally same thing with great the, anecdote. the blood's moving through the vessels that are all stiff and tight, right? It's going to be mm -hmm. uh, more pressure on them potentially, right? Mm -hmm. Another one I like doing is pinching the back of your hand here. 
yeah. and it should snap back ideally, right? We've had a lot Absolutely. of patients that just stays up there. That's called tenting, Oof. which is that goes with it, hydration and elastin hydration. status. So, well, and, look at that. And omega and omega status, oh, right? Okay, right. Grab your RX omega. <laughs> there you go. We just gave that the other day to somebody, but anyways. Carrie, wow, it's already been 25 minutes. Look at We're that. Good. Give us a little recap Boom. then for all the customers that are that are shopping here, looking for that skin, beauty, hair, skin, nail support, and now potentially cardiovascular. What's a good wrap-up yeah. message here? Well, I hope that you're looking for collagen because I think collagen is something that we should all be supplementing with for the rest of our lives. Like it is going to benefit everybody. My anecdote is that I heard from a 76-year-old man. He's been doing different collagens for, for decades because of the bone and joint. Yeah. And he had crepey skin on his hands and he started doing total body collagen. And within 28 days, the crepey skin was gone. And this is like, I mean, and he's in like a dude, you know, we don't think about it for yeah. men. So this is not a female beauty thing. It is for everybody. But when we are thinking about purchasing a collagen, please look into what the sourcing is. Ask the questions. Yep. Where is this coming from? What sort of testing is done? Is there any clinical research and data specifically to show me that I am going to be getting benefits? Otherwise, it's like all things in, in our world, something that somebody knows they can make money off of, they're probably going to find the cheapest source available that is not going to be beneficial for you and actually could be a problem if it has toxins in it. Beautiful. Maybe naturalfactors.com is a good starting point. Absolutely. Yes. And I'm always going to, as usual, link the phone number down below if you want to call them directly. But we carry mm -hmm. the full line right here at Healthy Habit Health Foods as well. Carrie, thank you so much for your time. Yeah. As always, you're amazing. See you next time. See you next time.